Hey guys, today um, I'm going to be doing a Beetlejuice um, eye look. I am really excited. So, first I'm just going to prime my eyes with the Beetlejuice base. <clears throat> In Aroma 01, it's pretty standard, you guys know that. I'm burning a new candle today. I'm burning the Dusk, um, what's it called? It's called... Um, Passion fruit souffle. I'm so excited. It smells so good. I really like it. I'm start. I feel like I'm starting to run out of time in the year, guys. Like I have so much planned, and my thing that I'm stressing about for big time at the moment is money. I'm just hoping that I'm going to be able to afford everything that I have planned. Um, but yeah, that's a problem for another day. I will know sooner to the day to the date that I'm planning these things. Anyway, today I'm gonna start by jumping into my um, Be Perfect Carnival palette and we're going to take the shade called Wasted. I'm gonna spend quite a bit of time building this shade up because we all know what purples are like. They're patchy, they're annoying to work with. So yeah, honestly, I'm probably just gonna spend a fair bit of time just on this shade, just placing it down and then really like trying to blend it it is such a pretty shade though i'm so excited i want to do like a um full face beetlejuice look as well but i thought for today i'll do an eye look i feel bad because i feel like my last couple of looks have been eye looks but i've just been finding so many that i like you know this is such a pretty purple shade wow love it i feel like this is another one of those instagram trends like Pretty much every beauty guru has done this look i feel like um it's another one that kind of like the um cut crease one i feel like it's gone around instagram i'm not 100 percent sure who started it um but yeah it's just one of those ones that literally every year at halloween it comes up um and this year i thought i would try it i'm gonna be honest i'm really quite pleased with this purple like it's good it's good i was expecting it to be patchy and annoying because most purples are patchy and annoying but no I am very I'm very pleased so there you go thank you be perfect oh god I've only been blending for like one minute my arm's really sore I don't know why this doesn't normally happen oh guys I had the worst dream last night I can't, like I don't remember like a hundred percent what happened but I keep getting like little like flashbacks I guess of what happened in there it makes me sad it was a really sad dream I can't really a hundred percent remember but I just know it was sad in my dream I like cut my hand or something because I remember waking up and like in the dream like because it was cut really badly I had to like hold it in between my legs and like press really hard um to like stop the bleeding and that's how I woke up with like my hand like like clenched between my legs because I was stopping the bleeding in my dream and obviously that's what I was doing in my sleep so that might be why my arm is tired because sleeping the weird way but yeah I don't know it was just a sad dream I don't really remember 100% why but <laughs> my Fenty Beauty looks I mean, my Fenty Beauty sponge looks so funny now that it has a chunk taken out of it. I should really buy another one soon, actually. Um, I feel like Mike's getting a bit old now. So I'm probably pretty happy with how this looks. Um, I'm going to cut my crease today, so that's probably what I'll go and do now. Yeah, so I'm going to go cut my crease, and then I will be back. Okay, so I have my cut crease done now, and I just need a... Um, I need, like, a white shade. I'm just going to take... Pillow Talk from the um, palette. I'm going to do this a bit differently, okay? So first I'm just going to set my eyes with the white. I feel like the white isn't actually as pigmented as I thought it was going to be. Okay, so before I add the black stripes, I'm actually going to do the liner first um, because... I want the green to be opaque. So I'm going to take the Sava Beauty Hydro Fix liner in 
fanny pack. I'm going to use this first. I'm just going to spray some setting spray into it and then mix it around. Just like that. Just do the same over the other side. Okay. So now that that's done, we need to add the little black, um, you know, but I don't know how to do that. I don't know if I should do it with liner or if I should do it with, I should, I might try liner first. I'm going to take my Too Faced one because it's really, um, fine. I just want to see how many stripes and stuff he has. I feel like they're quite thick, aren't they? Maybe I should draw the outlines with the liner and then fill them in with the black eyeshadow. Alright, I'll take a small brush and do the black eyeshadow. I don't know if this will be dark enough, but we'll try it. Yeah, I don't think that's going to work. It's definitely going to have to be eyeliner. It's just not pigmented enough. And I'll still put some black eyeshadow on just so it's a bit easier to do. Like, But yeah, it's definitely... We'll have to do fillers in with the eyeliner. Could take my um, face paint. I might use another eyeliner then because this is one of my favourites and I don't want to use it. <laughs> I might take my Tarte Kitten one because it's quite, it's on the way out, you know. Okay, I might do this off camera because this is going to take me forever, but I will do that off camera and then I'll be back. Oh my god, this took me so long. Um, I decided to use the Anastasia liquid liner to fill them in. That worked heaps better because it's a, um, a brush tip, not a felt tip. And then I just took the Colourpop No Filter Concealer in Fair 00 and went in between the black to make the white stand out a bit more. So now I'm going to go put lashes on. I'm actually going to have something to eat because I'm starving. Um, and then I'm going to do my face and then come back and show you the finished look. But so far so good. I feel like it looks really cool. So see you guys soon. Okay, this is the finished look. I do really like it. Um, you can see it's starting to crease really. So it's not a very practical look, but I feel like it's a nice, fun, creative one. Oh yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, <clears throat> I really hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!